It's nice to see you, Patty. Zach, nice to see you. This is uh, Zach Smith and Smythe. I'll let you do the introduction, Zach, if you will. Who's the lady to your right? Patty Smythe. Nice to see you, Patty. Who's behind you? Benji King. All right. And who's behind you? Tommy Price. Tommy, nice to have you with us. And lastly? Keith, Keith Mack. Hey! <laughs> nice to have you with us, Keith. Thank you very much. Let me jump into the middle here. I was talking to the lady over there. <laughs> help, help! Dick Clark! Yeah, yeah. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. You're right. You're a Philadelphian by birth or not? No, I'm actually a New Yorker. I just am. Uh, once we moved Philadelphia. Where were you brought up? In what area in of New York? In Manhattan and Brooklyn. And where were Brooklyn. you? Brooklyn. Brooklyn. Where were you brought up? In Connecticut. All right, now how did you meet this lady? Uh, I had gotten her name and I kept calling her and calling her and calling you her. You returned your calls she, immediately. No, no, no. She doesn't return calls. And uh, I finally got a hold of her at a restaurant. She answered a pay telephone and I said, now, Patty, I'm never going to speak to you for not returning my phone calls. And she said, who is this? <laughs> who is this fool? Why did you have I any call idea? Him back? Yeah, but I didn't know who he was. You don't return anybody's calls? I do, but nobody would give him my telephone number because he looks sort of sleazy or something, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> now, wait a minute. Just, just a minute. I don't want to get into this hassle. This is not, not a romantic involvement. This is a business <laughs> arrangement. Now, he called you not for a date. He called you for, to work, right? Yeah, to work. He had interviewed about 50 or 60 singers that he wanted to work with and write with. And I walked in. He never even heard me sing. It was just he hated me. I hated him, and we're together now. <laughs> and it all worked out. Why do you think there's so much opportunity for women in music now? I just always liked working with women, and I think there's been a lot less ground covered musically. Yeah. The guys have, have plowed that field real well. They've got, gone into every nook and cranny there is of the music. Well, it's been boys' bands forever, you know, and until recently. Uh, so I think there's just a lot of, a lot of room. Really. Are, are you a, a women's liberation lady? No, I'm not. I'm just independent, but I don't, I'm not a feminist, if that's what you mean. All right. What's going <laughs> to happen? No, you, I, I don't even, you know what? I've never given it any thought. I've never had any prejudice for That's or against because me. because you're a guy, Dick, you know what I mean? It's like, <laughs> She's really a salty guy. She's really, she's really, York, really Dick, salty. You've been out here a long time, I know. And you, I mean, where, <laughs> I, I'm speechless. You've attacked me here in my own home ground. No, it's nice to Have you been guys. out traveling around the road with these crazies? We've been on a crazy promo tour. It's just actually been Zach and I. We've yeah. been for three weeks going to the northwest, the southeast, the north north, the south south, and Africa. meeting all the DJs yeah. and all that. It's really been a lot of fun. Are you <laughs> happy that things are going well? Seriously, I mean, we didn't we not review this record? Raider yes, record. Raider record. And it a, did well. I got a call on my answering machine. Somebody said you got an 89, and the kids can dance to it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like the beat. It's easy to. We'll do it again today. Fear not. No, it's a hit, and maybe we help find it who knows